Hi there, this is Jeanette Reidenauer. I've been talking with you about the uh, 2004 Prairie Schooner we have here on the lot. I'm going to do a quick walk around the outside, show you the generator, the storage, uh, batteries and, and propane tanks, and then we'll go ahead and go inside. If you have any questions, just uh, shoot me an email and let me know. I'm going to go ahead and turn this around. So this is the Prairie Schooner from the outside. You can see that the decals on the front are a little cracked. The rest on the side are, are really not bad considering the age. This is the gas generator that we have in here. It's a 6,000 watt generator. Um, it is a gas generator, so it has been equipped with this exhaust muffler on the bottom. You can see here that it does have the double slides on this side. The front is the bedroom slide and the back is the living room slide. We've got seven gallon propane tanks here in the front. And I apologize for the craziness. I'm doing this by myself. So um, this is the entrance for your pass through storage on the driver's side. Refrigerator vent, fresh water connection, your exterior shower is, is right there. I can show you the dump valves underneath. And so that you can see that the underneath is enclosed. Schooner does have a roof, roof, rack, and ladder. It also was equipped with this uh, receiver hitch in the back. It is welded on. Unfortunately, I don't have a weight capacity for that receiver hitch. Um, the seller let us know that he he uh, pulled just about anything he wanted to with that thing, but unfortunately, we just can't give you a safe weight that you can pull with that at this time because we don't know. Uh, how it was installed and then it goes underneath the insulation underneath so uh, we, we can't really tell. The awning fabric is new. It was just replaced. Your battery compartment with both batteries here and then the other side of your pass-through storage. walking up inside um, all of the day night shades are in good shape this one that's right behind this couch will need to be restrung um, otherwise I think it will work but it will need to be restrung all of the other ones in the sides in the back area and in the bedroom work work just fine we do have a microwave that we will put in that box up there it was broken when it came in but we will replace it cabinetry, lots of storage underneath. Additional counter space. Um, this table was moved. It was over here in the slide. Uh, right where these recliner, this recliner is now. Um, the, you can see the bolts on the bottom that hold your table there. You can move it back, you can keep it where it's at. Um, it, it rides safely with this table in the back. I can show you the roof. It is nice and sturdy. There is no water damage, no water spots. your refrigerator. Entertainment center. We don't have a TV that goes in this one. Um, we can get it and of course upgrade it with the TV if you'd like. That vent will go back up. We're in the process of doing the 
uh, inspections when they come in we do inspections and then we do inspections before they go out I can show you it's got the three burner gas stove and inside the oven it'll need to be wiped down a little bit better this is a pretty deep slide uh, considered a super slide i do see here on this glass there is a little crack here and then walking into the bedroom we've got the bed the bed um, it does have a memory foam topper on this mattress in the cold which it's really cold it's kind of hard but as you lay into it it gets warmer the wardrobe closet additional closet space here it's been equipped with these um, shelves that add just more space for your stuff um, again I think Valerie went over it with you there is no water damage from um, the spot that's on the roof and we will make sure that that spot is watertight and fixed before we let it go anywhere. You've got an open bathroom with your shower and the master bedroom and sink. And then here inside that door is going to be your, your toilet, your commode. You can see that all of these drawers are in good shape. There's also this privacy accordion door that will go all the way across to give you privacy while you're sleeping. And then the bathroom area you've got the racks on the back of the door for additional hangers clothing anything you need this RV does come with the sprayer for the toilet it's real handy <laughs> medicine cabinet the bedroom does have the additional air conditioner here that is not a ducted air conditioner that's just going to give you air for the bedroom uh, but the rest of the rv is ducted with the air conditioner that that sits for out here it does also have a ceiling fan to circulate that air so just turn around here for you so you can get a good idea of everything Let me show you the roof. Really good shape. No water spots, no water damage. Everything around the slides looks really great. Tank sensor monitor, ceiling fan, outdoor lights, and kitchen lights. This is your generator meter uh, counter. You can see that it has 83 hours on it. And then this is just a, a coat closet here right in the beginning, or right in the entryway. And some shelves. So I uh, let me know if there's anything else that you want to see, and I'm happy to get pictures, um, another video. I'm going to run back inside and send this to you. So I'll talk to you soon. Thanks so much.